Okay, time to party. Now, I didn't really feel like doing this, but uh, I did promise you a video. As you guys like to just stick with these conspiracy th conspiracy theories for some reason. Now, now you did give me the FBI page, which did say zero for murder in the Newtown area of, of uh, Connecticut. And but the problem is I attempted to do this earlier and I did come across... Well, I go to Wikipedia, which is what I did for my book, because Wikipedia provides everything in one page. I just it was all just simply a matter of verif verifying each each piece of information. That's what what I attempted to do, but I got tired and whatever. Uh, so apparently, the uh, I can't even remember his name, but uh, the shooter does exist according to various sources. So it's basically a matter from there. It's a matter of those sources versus that FBI page that you showed me. Because if the FBI page is true, then uh, either that that shooter for the Sandy Hook school does not exist, or the P FBI page is simply lying. So, I don't know. Anyway, so what I'm going to do is, well, you say Google David Wheeler right here, so I'm going to do that right now in with uh, what's this Ober talks to Francine and the Wheelers Francine and David Wheeler suffered from a violent loss of their son Ben Now, as Oprah discovers the this Newtown, Connecticut couple scoping on the way, we don't know. Okay, what's I've adjusted the volume on my interface again. I'm sorry that the, that the sound is low. I don't know. How, I got to really tinker with this thing, but I forgot to look at the uh, date of the, of these pages. And looking at it now, as I edit this video. And looking at the picture of the guy, this guy does not look like he was a kid seven years ago. So that's a real fucking problem right there. What's going on here? David Wheeler is the father? And his son, Ben, was killed? Uh, okay. Um, yeah, David Cole is the father, or David Cole Wheeler, as it says here, he's the father. So, I mean, all you gave me was a picture. I'll look that up right now, actually. Okay, uh, I'm not sure if it'll be in this thread or not. Oh yeah, right here. Okay, so you didn't not while well, this this picture does not have any names on it. Well, I mean, how is this proof? And then uh, then I ask you. Never mind that. Yeah, there's no names on this. So, I mean, I don't understand how you people can just send somebody a picture and call it evidence of anything. This says nothing. It says Sandy Hook victims, but how does doesn't this not how is this proof? I mean, well, the FBI picture you showed me was legitimate because I went to the site and it is their official site, so I don't know. But um, okay, yes, yeah, Sandy Hook was fake. Again, another fucking picture. No, I can't arrest him. What does that fucking mean? You can't. He can't arrest himself. We need to talk about Sandy Hook. So right now, like this is annoying. I, I, you know, I have to uh, come down on you for this. Well, both of these pictures, but at the simultaneously, the the FBI page was legitimate. And I'll look that up right now, actually. 
Where is it? Uh, right there. Yeah, so. Unless this page is lying. Like, how honest is the FBI? That would be the question from here. I mean, yes, I asked you for this, but maybe that was wrong on my part. Because Newtown, zero for murder and non-regulant, non-negligent manslaughter. So, in the city, or, yeah, 2012. So maybe they're hiding it, who knows? Can you prove that? I guess that would be the, I guess maybe that's what I should have done from there. Okay, so, go here. Okay, Sandy Hook Elementary school, school shooting occurred on December 14, 2012. Connecticut, United States, a 20-year-old. Adam Lanza, that was, yeah, shot and killed 26 people. 20 of the victims were children between 6 and 7 years old, and the 6 were adult staff members. Earlier that, er, yeah, earlier that day before driving to the school, he shot and killed his mother at their new town home. And mem I remember reading it earlier, killed, him. yeah, says it right there. So, Adam Blanza should be dead. Now, looking at that alone, okay, Adam Blanza. ABC News. Now, I do this, and this is what I did throughout my Donald Trump book. But the problem is, what sources do you trust and why? And can you prove those sources are legitimate? And, uh, I mean, I can only, like, I don't know what sources are legitimate. I can only go by what what sources are on Google's first page and even second and uh, compare the two because none of neither of us have personal experience I don't know about you and even if you did how do I know you're honest I know I haven't I don't I'm not American I've never been well I have been to it not I've never been to Connecticut I don't think certainly not in 2012 okay if I have disturb no I don't need okay care about about him uh, okay two years after the Sandy Hook Elementary School massacre Connecticut's office of the child's Adv advocate release of report okay what am I looking here as okay so this this source confirms uh, the existence of Adam Lanza or yeah Adam Lanza and that he is responsible for the school massacre but uh, I don't know how credible this page is and I don't know I don't know which pages you trust and I don't even know if those pages that you trust are legitimate those are the problems right now aside from uh, David Wheeler being the father and not the son as you claim David Wheeler is the uh, crisis actor as you showed me in that uh, Useless picture. Okay, so Britannica.com. Now, does this confirm Adam Land's exis uh, existence? And, yeah, okay. Sandy Hook Elementary School shooting, also called Newtown Shootings in 2012. Um, so this is confirming that did happen. 28 dead, 2 injured. Uh, after mur after murdering his mother in the home, yeah, okay, so it's also saying that twenty children and six adults. That now that information might be a little different. I don't know, but that would only mean that small errors. But regardless, Britannica.com is also confirming both. Okay, History.com. I don't trust that. USAToday.com. Uh, 
Yeah, as you can see, I already checked because uh, I already tried going through this, but I just got tired and didn't really know what I was doing yet. I had to think things over. Well, the reason for that is, um, like, uh, I, well, I needed the names for those crisis actors. So, Sandy Hook school shooter had scorn for humanity according to newly released documents. So this is almost, okay, so, yeah. Okay, so it's, yeah, this one is also confirming we don't have a name. Okay, well, Adam Lanza, of course. 20 children, 6 educators. So it's, each one of them is getting the 20 children. That That's what they all have in common. And this. And then he took his own life. I don't know about the 6 educators. But that's... I can't even remember. I already, I've already forgotten. Um, so, yeah. Now let's take a look at one more. Okay, uh Yeah. In Peter Lanz's new house on a secluded private road in Fairfield County, Connecticut, in an attic room overflowing with shipping crates, yeah fuck off. Since uh yeah, Adam killed his own mother, himself, twenty six people at Sandy Hook Elementary School. Strangers from across the world have sent. Uh, okay, so this is essentially confirming it. Yeah, well, Adam killed his own mother himself. Yeah, okay, so this also says the same shit. So right now it's those uh, sources versus your FBI recommended FBI, or well, provided FBI link. But the question is, how can I? I guess maybe all I can really do is, you're the one with the claim here, not me. My question at this point is, suppose this was a hoax and all of these various sources of media are all making this up to make it a hoax, turning this whole thing into a hoax. Why? And why use Adam Lanza? What's going on here? What would that be? Uh, I think a big problem is while you guys are you right wingers are running around along with Alex Jones and various other pundits running around yelling and screaming about this this being a hoax you're not looking into all you're doing is running around trying to make convince other people that it is a hoax instead of looking into it yourselves and getting to the bottom of why I mean, that's the main, that's one of the main problems I have with all you people. Uh, you look at all these various sources and you blame the media for being dishonest and everything. You chase after them. Well, how are you guys any fucking better? So I, I can only leave it to you to provide the proof of that, that the FBI is making, or is, is being honest, or, or if, uh, these, if we if you can, prove that all these sources are bullshit so it's it's these sources versus that FBI page at this point so I don't know what to do with this um, I mean what what re what research have you done oh I went off the page fuck okay what am I doing here okay so I mean that's all I can really do that's all there is to this. Because that's... What more information would be necessary? Maybe the FBI... Uh, 